What do you make uh, of, of this slaughter rule? What is it? Bring us up to date. Well, the slaughter rule is nothing more than a power grab by an out of control uh, leadership in the House of Representatives. The Article 1, Section 7, Clause 2, every bill which shall have passed the House of Representatives and the Senate shall, before it becomes law, be presented to the President of the United States. Well, if they're not voting on a bill, but they're voting on a package of amendments they call reconciliation to a bill that's never passed, they're not presenting the President with anything. Furthermore, the clause says, in all such cases, the votes of both houses shall be determined by yeas and nays, and the names of persons voting for and against the bill shall be entered on the journal of each house, respectively. Not vote, you can't vote on an amendment to a non-existent bill. This is the most brazen assault on a fundamental aspect of our republic ever. And if it occurs, it is clearly a constitutional crisis. All right, but this Congresswoman Slaughter who, who, who came up with this, I think she sits on the Rules Committee. They who control the majority apparently can make their rules, right? No, they who control the majority still have to follow the Constitution. See, a Congressman Slaughter, when she's long gone, doesn't get to amend the Constitution just because she's a temporary chairman of the uh, House Rules Committee or Pelosi's a temporary speaker. Politicians come and go. The Constitution is our bedrock. And so uh, the slaughter rule is nothing more than a brazen authoritarian attempt to get something they can't get legitimately. They wanted, legitimately. They wanted an up or down majority vote on the bill, so do it. They won't do it because they'll lose. So what they're saying is, well, we want this anyway. The people don't want it. The Constitution doesn't allow it, so we're going to ram it through anyway. This is, I want to repeat, a, a, a brazen violation of the Constitution. It is 100 times worse than Watergate if they pull this. And it is one-party rule, but it is an unconstitutional rule.